So today I'm testing out my new live recording interface. This interface gives me 16 channels of Focusrite preamps with the new Focusrite Octopre Dynamic. Um, the beauty of the Octopre Dynamic is that on each channel it includes a compressor. Uh, the compressor that's in these two pieces is based off of the uh, Focusrite uh, Red, which is a simple single knob compressor. Uh, and it very excitingly has a more button, which is uh, a great simple feature. Um, this system was designed for syncing up live video with live audio. Um, the main problem we have when we shoot things live is that a lot of times the sound that we capture from the camera mics uh, does not give justice to the performance. It also doesn't give us any flexibility as far as going back and uh, remixing anything. So a lot of times we find the audio, the vocals are uh, low. So this uh, Fire Studio light pipe has a capacity of up to 32 channels of ADAT at 48 kilohertz. Um, it's ADAT only input. Um, and if you want less channels with higher range, you can go up to 96 kilohertz, um, which brings you down to 16 channels. So the other nice feature about this system is that there's no uh, knobs. There's no output knobs. So when you go to set up something live, you really want it to be bomb proof. The uh, Personas only does output to Firewire and there's no no controls on that. Um, the Octopre does a very similar thing where it has no output controls at all. The only controls you have are gain. So when you set when you do your mic check, whatever levels you set the mics at, uh, it gives you the a mirror image of that on the output side. So on the back you go from uh, they have combination plugs, so it's not just a uh, XLR, but it'll take a quarter as well. Um, but the output section is quarters only. So you can take your quarters out and run them uh, back into the snake. So this goes in between the snake and the board. Um, and as you can see, we're testing this system out with a array of 16 different mics, all sizes, shapes, uh, some that require phantom power and some that don't, just to make sure that the system is bomb proof and can do with any live recording situation. It's been a long time that I've been thinking about this particular system and uh, I'm glad that I finally got it together and that uh, I have high hopes for what it will be able to do as far as live recording to get us good audio to go with our video. And uh, as soon as I get some footage shot, I will post those results.